you're gonna train the calves, okay? The calves are the, probably the hard, one, one of the most hardest muscles to develop any real size and um, there's a few misunderstandings around calves. Calves are notoriously difficult to build. It's really, really hard to build size and strength on the calves. One of the reasons is we're using the calves every day, probably all day, okay? Because you're walking around them and they're a very strong muscle, they're a very durable muscle, so you have to really smash them in order to develop and stimulate uh, growth or re a reaction out of the muscle. So you have to do a mixture of two exercises, straight leg calf raise, seated calf raise. Because the calf muscle, what we call a calf muscle, is actually two muscles. It's the gastrocnemius and soleus. It's two muscles that we have to activate. And you can only really activate them with a straight leg lift and a bent leg lift, okay? That's the only way that you really catch them properly. So every gym should have at least two calf machines, like this gym, okay? So I'm gonna demonstrate firstly the straight leg calf raise, okay? So we're gonna come in here. It's important to remember that your foot the ball of your foot, the ball of your foot being this part here, is placed on the edge, okay? We don't want too much of the foot on or too little of the foot on, otherwise you're gonna slip. So this is the part here, okay? I'm gonna come in here, and like I said, now the legs are dead straight. Head up, we wanna go as deep as possible. We want that muscle to stretch the muscle fibers as much as we can, okay? We wanna avoid this. This is the bounce. This is the bounce, we wanna go Stretch, contract, peak. Stretch, peak. Me, personally, I'm not saying for everyone, I like to go stretch, halfway, down, full way. Stretch, halfway, down, full way. This is my one repetition. Okay, one repetition. Okay. Okay, if I wanna change this now and start hitting the muscle, from different angles, I simply move the position and angle of my feet. So now, doing it from this technique is I'm hitting, from this technique I'm hitting the inner part of the, the muscle. If I change it round again to this position and do the same motion, okay, I'm hitting this part of the muscle, okay? If I'm going just standard here, here, I'm hitting this part of the muscle, okay? So, just by changing the positions of the feet is changing the positions that you attack the muscle from, okay? Like I said, calves are really hard to, to stimulate because we use them all the time, so any extra advantage that we can get when we're training them, like moving positions of feet, do it, you know, do it. So do, if you're doing a rep, uh, a series or a set of, of 15 reps, should be do five, 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 okay? So you're changing the position of the foot all the time. Now this is the straight leg. The next um, exercise we're gonna use is the seated. Like I said, we have to hit the gastrocnemius and the soleus. You can't do it efficiently enough just by using straight leg or just by doing bent leg by themselves. You have to mix the two, okay?